Not only is this the most versatile and powerful battery that can run almost anything you want to plug in, but it's got a 4.9 star average customer review rating and it is on sale for the lowest price I've ever seen. Now I've been using the Delta Pro for over three months now, so I'll be answering some of your guys' top questions and sharing both the positives and the negatives of this insane battery system. First off, I want to be honest with you guys and let you know that we get an insane amount of companies that want to send us stuff and I've personally said no to most of those because the products are not good. But when EcoFlow reached out and they wanted to partner with us and I looked into what they offer and how much better it is than stuff that I have personally bought, I said, all right, let's go ahead and check it out, see how well it does. And overall, it has blown away my expectations and I'll explain why. Starting out, one of the most important things is the longevity of this battery because if you're gonna spend the money, you want it to last and you want it to last a long time and most brands don't really wanna talk about this because theirs don't. You can completely drain this Delta Pro every single day, which by the way, can charge an iPhone 14 about 300 times on one charge or an M2 MacBook Air about 70 times on one charge and after draining it every single day for 10 years, you will still have about 80% of the original capacity remaining, which is about seven times better longevity than most other large scale batteries like this on the market. And after 20 years, you will still have about 50% of the original capacity. That is insanely good, and that's because EcoFlow is using the same LPF battery tech that Teslas use, which is way more sustainable and environmentally friendly as well. Now, because of how long they last, some people are actually using them not only for home backup, but to actually save on their electricity bill since they can charge them while the electricity is cheaper off peak hours and then use it during the time they would be billed more. Now, before I give you guys all the features and the specs, I wanna tell you how and what I have been using it for. First off, I really wanted one of these for camping. Now, we absolutely love going out camping with the family. We have this trailer that makes it really easy and convenient for our kids, especially with their skin issues. Uh, being outside in a tent with dust makes it so we don't go camping, which we didn't do for many years. Now, some of the spots that we go to don't have power hookups, you're off grid. And the fact that this thing has a full size RV hookup is amazing because not only can we run things like lights, uh, turn on the heaters for our dragon. Uh, it can also run things like the microwave and even the AC, which won't run off of the trailer batteries themselves. And those also drain extremely quickly. Uh, this has made it so we don't really have to worry about going out and having the power to run things that we need. Uh, and also using the app, you can see everything. And I'll talk about that in just a bit. With that, the Delta Pro can actually charge your Tesla or another EV with the right adapter, which is absolutely crazy. Uh, previously, I showed off the Delta 2, which is a smaller scale battery that is powerful, but it does not have that uh, 30 amp, so it can't do things like the AC. Um, and that works great. I showed off, you know, being able to move it and we were making waffles, boiling a kettle, all of those kind of things. And of course the EcoFlow Delta Pro can do all of that as well but it just has a much bigger capacity, which we'll talk about. Now, some of the other uses that I've been doing with this, other than going camping, is at my house, I've been working on the playground that you guys have seen. My kids are absolutely enjoying that, uh, but that thing is about 150 feet away from any outlet. So I have to have multiple extensions tied, then I have to remove them, put them back up. And moving this thing over with its built-in handle is very easy, it has wheels that it can roll and so lately I've been building up this actual play structure uh, and so I brought out my air compressor plugged it in and because the air compressor turns on builds up pressure and turns off I mean I can use this thing 
just one charge for multiple days of doing work and it runs everything without any issues or any hassle it is extremely convenient now it also has a bunch of other ports so I'm not limited with what I want to uh, connect to it and I'll let you guys know how long this battery lasts for a lot of different appliances in just a bit now at home the other major reason why I wanted it is because it can back up your house if the power goes out as well now outside I actually have a hookup for a generator and it hooks up to 20 with a switch on my breaker box hooking up the Delta Pro I can get off of grid power if it's out and then select which breakers I want to be on so if I want to run multiple different rooms I want to run lights my refrigerator even my stove now you can actually power multiple of these together that gives you a lot more power and up to six of them with a smart home breaker kit saving power and monitoring which is really cool now the build quality is also great you have this plastic case but is extremely durable now in the front we have a bunch of connections starting out with four regular 110 volt ports 20 amps max so you can connect any accessories any chargers whatever you want you can run an extension from there if you do want to plug something in and then we also have that very powerful a 30 amp connection like I showed you for the RV. We have four USB type A ports, two of them are standard and the other two are designed for smartphones, tablets, because they have fast charging, they could adjust their voltage to maximize that, as well as two USB-C ports that offer up to 100 watts output. That means even with a 14 inch MacBook Pro, you can get fast charging to get to 50% in 30 minutes with those ports. And like I said, the M2 MacBook Air, you can charge that about 70 times from one charge. Now hidden on the side here, we have a bunch of other outputs. You have a barrel plug, we have this 12 volt 30 amp output at the top, as well as the smaller barrel plugs to hook up different accessories. And then we have some switches. Uh, we have a remote control that can plug into here if you want to see everything at a distance if you're tucking these away. There's a lot of options. Now to charge this thing, you also have a ton of options. Of course, you can plug it into a regular wall outlet and it will fully charge in 2.7 hours. That is extremely fast for a battery that has this capacity. A regular MacBook takes about that long to charge. Now along with that, you can actually charge it in as low as 1.8 hours if you combine different options. So for example, you can actually charge this uh, with solar panels. I'll talk about the one that I have. You could also charge it from a car with that outlet. You can combine multiple ones and you can actually charge this at an EV station with an adapter that you can get from them. So that is really fast as well. So as far as charging, there are no issues. They also have a dual fuel smart generator which you can plug in and the reason that it's smart is that it will actually turn on automatically, it communicates with this. So as soon as the battery is low at whatever level you want, it will kick in automatically, charge it up, it'll actually boost the wattage if you're pulling at the same time and then shut itself off and you don't have to use just gasoline, you can run it off of propane which has a better shelf life, uh, it's a lot more convenient, in many cases it's less expensive and that is really convenient because you can have one of these it won't die and you have continuous power now this thing could be a solar generator as well I have a 220 watt bifocal solar panel and that means that not only does it have 220 watts of solar on the front it actually has 155 watts on the back side and when you set it up it can actually pick up extra power or extra solar that was lost and so when it bounces up for example concrete works really well but even on grass it will pick up extra uh, energy from the sun and convert that which is really cool but you can hook up a bunch of different solar it actually is compatible with up to 90 percent of the solar that's on the market and with the compatible panels you could charge this from 5.6 hours all the way down to 2.8 hours just from free energy from the sun which is really sweet they also have this insane solar panel mount kit that will actually move the panel and adjust to get the optimal amount of energy from the sun. 
Now, as far as the capacity, this thing has 3,600 watt hours of battery capacity. Now, I showed off the Delta II, that has about 1,000, and then I expanded it with the second battery, giving me 2,000. But this thing has 3,600, and it can reach up to 25,000 watt hours when you hook it up the, using the full system and the smart panel to your house. Now, as far as power output, like I said, it has 3,600 watt standard, and with X Boost, it can go up to 4,500 and it has a surge rating of 7,200 watts if something spikes up and of course you can also double that if you connect two of these bad boys together. Now another question you guys have asked is how long will this last for using various appliances? Well on their website they have this cool tool that will give you all the info. For example, for a light that is 10 watts, which is actually quite a bit higher than a standard LED at about six, you'll get 337 hours if you're connected over DC, which is more efficient. If you have a CPAP machine, that will run about 50 hours. To run a TV, you get about 27 hours. A coffee maker, you'll get about 3.3 hours. Now, I know that doesn't sound like a lot. Same thing with a microwave at two and a half hours, but you're not gonna be microwaving for two and a half hours long. When I was using a kettle that also uses a lot of power, but you're done in just a few minutes when you're drawing that power because it's efficient, it's very fast. So in reality, if you're going camping, you're running things like a blender, other things uh, it's gonna last multiple days because you don't have it on now I showed you guys if you're charging up a phone about 300 times and a laptop right here 57 times for a 60 watt hour of course like a MacBook Air has a smaller battery than that so even with just one uh, it does last a long time and you guys should go and read the reviews as how some of these professional people are using this for a saw and a jackhammer they have very very good points and experience with it now I also wanna show you guys the app because it is extremely powerful and very handy to have. That really matters if you're buying one of these, to have something that is designed well, not something that lacks features. Uh, so here, you can just go ahead and add the Delta Pro. This thing has both Bluetooth and Wi-Fi, so even if you're somewhere where you don't have Wi-Fi, you'll still connect and be able to get all your info. On the homepage, I could see the capacity of the Delta Pro, the temperature. I also have the full info for the input. Obviously, nothing's plugged in, but we see all the different charging methods and a little graph. For the outputs, I can actually toggle the AC ports on and off. You guys hear that right now? Bam, it kicked on. I could turn it off. Also, the barrel plug and that uh, the other output on the side, all of my USB ports, I can see what wattage they're outputting. It is so nice to see that. Now we can go into the settings and I'll briefly go through all of this. I can adjust the discharge level. So if I don't want it to charge more than 80% or lower than certain speed, I could do that. With the AC charging, I can also bump that up. Bam, to 1800 watts. We have our car input the screen brightness, the smart generator, when you want that thing to kick on to recharge it, you have full adjustability. This app has been extremely handy when I'm inside at night in the RV, I've opened it up, I can see what level uh, the charge is at and I can actually shut it off without having to go outside so that uh, if I don't need to charge up the batteries anymore or run anything, I can save power, I can turn it on remotely as well, it has been awesome. So overall, this thing has been amazing, but what are the downsides? Well, first off, it is not cheap. Now it is priced better than the competition uh, while having having better features, very fast charging, and uh, the longevity that this thing's gonna last a very, very long time. Uh, but you still have to spend some money. And with that, this has a ton of storage capacity, so it is heavy, it's about 99 pounds. Now you do have that handle, so you can pull it easily. I even pulled it through grass. Um, that was not an issue, so I'm very glad they added it. If it was just the handles themselves, that would be a pain. You'd have to get into their wagon like you do with some of the other ones. Uh, but when it does come time to lift it up, be aware that this thing is not as light as the Delta IIs that I showed off previously. Other than that, I really have no other complaints. You guys saw based off of the reviews, people absolutely love these. It's a lot of value. Um, so if you're looking for something that can power an RV, can back up your home, can even with the adapter charge an electric vehicle, just in case you run out of power, I would take a look at one of these. They're very versatile, very powerful. So there you guys go. Go ahead and check out the links in the description. 
As a heads up, EcoFlow is having a Black Friday campaign soon from November 11th to the 28th. It's gonna be one of the best times to buy. And the reason I didn't mention price is because the price is variable. And for their products, they'll have up to 50% off. And with that, if you're gonna be buying multiple products, the more money you spend, you're gonna get free gifts that get better and better. So if you wanna buy a couple of these, pairing them together or anything else, go ahead and check out those links below and the deals that they have. Thank you guys for watching. Click that circle above to subscribe. Check out one of those great videos right over there. If you have any questions, ask down below. This is Max, and I'll see you in the next video.